Slow Quakey. So by this point, most people know about Moore's Law, which basically says that processing power doubles every two years. It's really about the number of transistors you can cram into a certain area, and we're reaching the physical limit of what we can do. But a lot of people are wondering why it is that computers seem to have maxed out on their power about 10 years ago. You really just can't seem to get a standard consumer processor with a clock speed higher than 4 GHz. The reason why is that that was when we hit the limit of a similar concept called Denard scaling. It was named after Robert H. Denard, who first proposed it in 1974. Technically, it says that as transistors scale down, power stays proportional to area. Basically, it means that smaller transistors can be faster with the same amount of power, and you can use more power to increase performance. At the time Denard proposed the law, the issue of power loss to thermal leakage, in other words, heat, was minimal. That wasn't the case by the early 2000s. Processors were running hotter and hotter and needed more sophisticated cooling. Here's the thing. The power that's lost as heat is taken from the power that would otherwise be running the processor. That's why Denard scaling broke down. It got to the point where if you made the processor any faster, it resulted in even greater power requirements and even more heat loss. It's generally agreed among computer scientists that Denard scaling broke down completely around 2006. This is the main reason for the advent of multi-core processors. They allow for greater processing speed at the same clock rate. It's also why we're offloading more and more tasks to GPUs. But the fact is, we're running up against the limits of pretty much all the computer scaling laws. When that happens, consumers will still be demanding faster computers. It may be that programmers will be faced with what they used to do out of necessity, but that's become kind of a lost art. Optimizing operating systems and applications to cut out all the crap and the bloat and just make them run faster.